sunny Tampa. NBC Suites, solid hotel. There's one buck place. There's the big flag flying away. Off in the distance, there's Raymond James Stadium, home of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. We're gonna look for parking and head over there, check out their brand new team store. We're here. This is Winston. We're heading over to the team store on the side here. It doesn't look like any other people here. Jesse's taking a picture in front of Porta Potty for some reason. Um, this is brand new and it opened up um, during the preseason. There used to be an unofficial store for the Buccaneers that was located somewhat close to the stadium called Buccaneer Heaven or Buck Heaven. Um, that closed down years ago when the team was not performing well. Uh, and that used to be the go-to place for people to be able to buy all kinds of Buccaneer stuff. Now, I'll be honest, for somebody like me coming out of Orlando, there's really not a lot of places to get Buccaneer stuff. For some reason, living in Orlando, the bulk of the stuff that gets sold is Miami Dolphins. It makes no sense. So we're in Tampa. We try to load up on Buck stuff while we're here. And right now, anxious to see what the store has in store for us. We're going in. Look at this. I want that little fridge. Check out this cooler. That's sweet. I'd love to get that for the patio. I want everything. Oh, Buccaneers. Barbecue grill. It's Mike Evans. And he's playing golf while he's in his football uniform. Oh, they got that football cooler. You got that little cooler. That little cooler is more than that cooler. And then we have those refrigerators. Oh my God, this is awesome. 600 bucks. Or you can go on a Buccaneers a picnic. No, oh, touchdown buddy. We could have a Buccaneers kids room. We need to have more kids. <laughs> yeah, not really. Jesse's almost six inches tall. <laughs> wow, this is nuts. Look at that. This is where my season tickets used to be, right up there. Look at this whole thing. This store is huge. Look at this. Wow. Should we get Buccaneers couch and pillows for the ladies? <laughs> also Buccaneers girl. In prior years, you probably really needed some of these things. By the way, you can go into the stadium from the store, but they have specific stickers in here that tell you that certain items cannot be brought in. Buccaneers earrings. Look at those. Those are nice. Mary's like, nah. I would wear those. Dooney and Burke purses. Turvis. Housewares. Cufflinks, wallets, ties. I have to be honest, I own two Bucks ties already. Bags, belts, socks, strong arms. Look at that. That's crazy. Slippers, PJs, toolboxes, golf stuff. There's a lot of balls. Whoa. That's pretty cool. Oh, flags. Nice. There's a Buccaneers bowl cover there for your salad. Buccaneers selfie stick. All right, now we might do some damage. Men's clothing. I like this. $110. It feels so nice. Golf shirts. <laughs> Just posing down. Isn't this a little workout shirt? Rain jackets. Oh, this is really cool in the back. Here's like a golf jacket. It's easy. Yeah, you're close. Here's another windbreaker. Oh, this is so light. This is a windbreaker. Nice. It's a helmet and it's also a speaker. This is like a lightweight version of that other sleeveless shirt that we had. No sleeves. Wow, this one is a lot more money. 186. I like this gray hat. This is for the Breast Cancer Awareness Month. I was actually looking at those. Nice. It's cheap too. This sweat jacket's pretty cool. It's got like a reflective logo on it. Nice. Team store exclusive. And they've got hats on 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 hats. Team store exclusive hats. 
that's cool. And it's backlit. Look at all of these shirts. It's like an endless amount. Same with polo shirts. Just tons of variety. Bathing suit trunks, team store exclusive. Jerseys, limited edition with sewn on letters. Buck 50, nice. Elite jerseys. So these are basically like the same that the players are wearing. These are 315 a piece. And then you got all of these guys and you could do custom jerseys. Big fan, 17. Got Winston in white, McCoy. I wouldn't mind a McCoy jersey. That looks nice. Last but not least, they have a pet section. <laughs> pet jerseys. All right, we just made our contribution to Tampa's tax receipts for the year. I love the background here. There's people upstairs working at the stadium. But the Bucks play in Minnesota today. Looking forward to a really good season. If you guys have been watching the channel for a while, you realize we've been to a few different Buccaneer events so far this year, preseason games, the training camp. I'm hoping they get far into the playoffs this year. I think they've got an amazing team. We're looking forward to seeing what they can do out there. We stopped at Chili's to eat. We didn't realize they're having like a Buccaneers party with cheerleaders and everything here. They have a whole Buccaneers trailer out here. Goodbye, Tampa. I for ultimate at work. Here we're back home from Tampa. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers store, really awesome. I kept the video somewhat short, I think. I'm not so sure that there's that many folks that watch the channel that are that hardcore into the Bucks like I am. Um, but very, very cool addition to the stadium. Um, long time Buccaneers fans know that typically when they used to sell merchandise, if you were interested while heading into the games or out of the games, they just basically had trailers outside or, you know, a while back they basically had like stuff up on a fence um, for um, like t-shirts and stuff on hangers and everything and it was kind of really not that slick looking. The Bucks just completed a ton of uh, refurbs and enhancements to the stadium, um, really getting the most life that they can out of the stadium. And the funny thing about Florida sports, I think, or Florida in general, is like buildings hit like 20 years and then all of a sudden everyone's clamoring to like tear them down and and build new stuff um, that stadium to me hasn't been there all that long um, but they continue to keep making more improvements to it make it more of a, a first class type of stadium experience and that team store is a great component of it so if you're in town I believe they're open Thursday through Sunday uh, those are their hours and on game day the hours shift um, to correspond with the game in any event, thanks a lot for coming along with us. And thank you very much for all of your likes and your comments and your subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. We'll see you guys.